Okay, I'm going to repeat the experiment with the plate. We're using the MMA process and we're measuring on the meter here the voltage of the arc between the um, electrode, which is a flux coated electrode 6013, and the workpiece here. You can see we've got a clamp. Um, previous to the last experiment, I've now coated this plate matte black to get better reading with the um, the IR remote temperature gauge. You can see we're starting now at a nice consistent 18.9 degrees everywhere. Okay, um, I have the electrode connected to the um, negative and we have positive return so we should be putting more heat into the work with this connection according to the theory. I'm not going to bother trying timing the world I'm just going to get that back off the video and I'll put it on as text on top for the uh, so we know how many um, seconds we put the world in but I'm going to try and do it for around about 10 20 seconds, maybe 20 seconds, get a bit of decent heat in there so we know what we're working with. I measured the current, confirmed the current with the settings, I haven't altered anything, it is 90 amps on this MMA. I'll turn it on, put my mask on if I can find it. Okay. Here we go then. Okay, at the top here we've got 140 degrees, 180 actually, quite close to the surface. Out here 60, out here about 120. Midway down the plate 50 degrees to 60, 40 over that side. In the bottom we're still quite cool, 23, 26, 27. Middle again, 56, 63, 47, top edge, 67, 90, 98. Okay, let's just keep measuring, 60, 57. 32, 37, 39, 55, 56, 49, 64, 74, 80. Actually evening out. Of course the black paint will actually act as more of a radiator in its uh, radiated heat loss. 39 hope this is visible on the camera 45 it's definitely getting warmer down the bottom now 45 45 in the middle 55 to 56 top edge 60 64 67 the whole thing's evening out to around about 60 because obviously we're losing heat everywhere anyway so okay that should be probably enough data to um, to see whether that matches up with some theory on the heat input for that um, hopefully we've got a good voltage on here when we were doing the arc welding
<coughs> okay. Just do a final check. 51, 54, 52, 55, 57, 58, down the bottom, 49, 50, 48. It's good enough for me.